God. Shannon yeah. family matter, no ifs, ands, or buts. Not picture perfect in them pictures, but it's really us. And we embrace all the love. Y'all be showing trust through the ups and downs. But it's good in front of you, know what? Keeping it ripping the beginning, we've been authentic. Even though baby getting big, still that is princess. LJ got in the college just like I predicted. Through thick and thin, it was sin, that's why she the missus. And that's the man of the house, I just play my role. So wipe your feet before you step foot through them doors. Cause this is not your typical television show. It's in the family matters, not the wins lows. What? Hi guys, welcome back to Shannon's Family Matters. And today I will be showing you guys my shoes that I got for my birthday. My birthday's in two days, and I will be having a birthday party. And I need scissors. Yeah. Thank you. It's kind of raining outside. Don't rain on my party. My party will be here at our house, obviously. Like it's gonna be lit, obviously. I'm turning 13, y'all. So yeah. They're cute, but like I don't know which ones these are. There was like the force, the force, the, the air force one. Are these the um I think these are the blue ones that I got. about that okay y'all y'all wait wait <laughs> omg i'm definitely gonna be y'all these are so cute actually what is that on there is that a plane ticket <gasps> y'all i'm not trying to get these dirty i'm not gonna get these creased y'all OMG, my parents have been promoted. Yes, I will be wearing these. I want to wear them Friday, the day of my birthday, but I have no outfit to wear with them. I want to go to the mall Thursday to go pick out an outfit. So Friday, I already have my outfit ready to go. And like, my dad is not ready to have a 13 year old like, y'all, I'm so excited to be 13 in two days, y'all. Okay, these might be the neon one. My party is glow, is a glow night theme. So this is my kind of neon shoes. Ooh, this is not. Okay, so I got these. I'm definitely going to be wearing these at my party. I like these because, like, this is going to go great with my outfit for Friday and I'm also getting my hair done Friday and I'm getting my nails done Saturday hopefully I think and then Friday I might be going to the mall with my dad to go look for some outfits to wear so yeah hey mom I'm recording you want to come say hi anyways so those are the shoes that I got and my mommy is about to come say hi to y'all, so. And she will be taking you over. Mm -hmm. Yes, she will. Anyways, so yeah. Take over. Take over. Thank you. <laughs> and I also got this, too. Plus more than her. Come say hi. Hi, guys. You like your shoes? Yes. What okay. is your daddy doing? In the bed. You try them out? No. Anyways. Hi guys. I'm making baked ziti today. No, you said you was making nah, fish and grits. Nah, I changed my mind. Mom. I'm making fish and grits tomorrow no. with everybody here. That's their fault that they're not here. Anyways, I bought Mom. $5 sushi. Your daughter's work is in two days. Are you excited? We gotta um, wash your hair huh? tomorrow night and straighten it. So you go to school. Would I pick you up? You're going to her. You can't put shit on it. Because if, if I pick, I might what have to. What if it's frizzy? Do you want me to pick you up early and we can wash your hair? What do you mean pick me up early? From school. So then Friday? we can. Yes. What time? I'll pick you up like 2 o'clock. 2 o'clock. 2 o'clock. Where would I be? I'll be in sixth period. No. I'll be. Yeah, I'll be in sixth grade. Tell your little boyfriend to give you your gift at your birthday party. Why? Why can't you just give it to me at school? Okay. 
I'll be back with y'all to cook after I eat this. Good afternoon, you guys. This is the next day, one day before baby's actual 13th birthday. Yes, you guys. Baby would be third motherfucking teen, bro. Y'all been around for a minute. This is crazy. But yes, even though I'm dreading this day simply because she wants to have a motherfucking house party at our motherfucking house with her motherfucking friends who motherfucking destructive. You feel me? I've been around these kids. Throughout football season, parties, baby don't went to for them, everything, bro, since they growed up. And it's crazy to have them at my motherfucking house all at one time. See, I can get them individually, but boy, when they a motherfucking group, a motherfucking cult, you pay me, a motherfucking tribe, a motherfucking gang, oh my God, it's going to be motherfucking bananas in this bitch. Bro. <sighs> I ain't never knew what anxiety was like. When Shane used to always say, I got anxiety, I'd be like, Shane, shut the fuck up. You feel me? Because I've never experienced it, bro. I, I, I'd be like, Shane, you watch too much motherfucking TV, too much motherfucking TikTok, too much motherfucking Instagram, too much motherfucking YouTube. Talk about motherfucking anxiety. You watch too much shit. It ain't no such thing. But boy, devil is a lie because I'm definitely having it right now. As y'all can see, I'm having a motherfucking panic attack. <sighs> Tomorrow is her actual birthday, but we're going to take her shopping and shit to get her prepared. So yeah, I took off work tomorrow for that reason. Oh my God, she's gonna get her hair done, she's gonna get her nails done, toes done, all type of shit. It's gonna be a busy day. I gotta take Kari to the dentist early in the morning. 
which is going to be crazy because he have to go way back to fucking Miami to do that, bro. So it's going to be crazy for me tomorrow. You feel me? Let alone Shane going to be ripping and running. LJ trying to haul ass. I'm like, nah, bro. This is what big brothers do. You're going to stay and help as a big brother with your sister party. You feel me? You're going to be motherfucking serving, cooking, all type of shit. You feel me? You talking about he finna haul ass. No the hell you ain't. Finna haul ass right out there on that motherfucking grill. You feel me? You gonna do something. No. You gonna be here. All of us gonna be here. Kari gonna be here too. Everybody, hands on. We gonna make this happen for your sister. Simple as that. So, that's what's going down. Y'all get ready for this as we get ready for this. I know y'all motherfuckers having anxiety because I'm giving it to y'all right now. And I'm making y'all have anxiety because I'm about to have it. And also, you guys, it's my brother's birthday. As y'all know, they birthday on the same day. So shout out my brother, old ass. He about to be 40, you feel me? So make sure y'all wish him a happy birthday as y'all wish him baby a happy birthday. Two special people in my life. My first and only daughter and my first and only big brother, bruh. Both birthday on the same day. It's crazy, but it's awesome. That's what it is. I'm going to fuck with y'all in a minute. Let me prepare myself. Well, I'm just home from work. I, got, I found it. <laughs> it was in there with the knives. How you put straws in there with the knives? What the hell? You deaf? Oh. Um, well, Cara said Davis we ain't got no struggle Davis meals. Where the struggle meals at? Davis, my wave is, I said hi. That's short for noodles. Guess whose birthday is in six hours? Oh, you? This girl. Yeah. Guess who else birthday in six hours? Who? You don't uh, know? Uncle Juju. Vax type shit. Mm-hmm. Here you go, using the 2024 words. Yeah, what you mean, stick to, man? Stick to 1998. Boy, that's crazy. 1998 is crazy. <laughs> 1998 is crazy. Born. I don't know where you was born. I'm an 80s baby. Oh, you're 1985? Yes, ma'am. But mom's 1998. No, mom's 1985 as well. So why she lied about her age? Her year? Why she storied? Why she storied about her age? Yeah, that's what they do. When they don't want to be old, they story about it. So... She said her birthday, her birthday was 1995, uh, nah. December 23rd. No, she lied. Um, yeah. We don't say lie, we say story tell. Man, bye Felicia. That's my auntie's name. It's your mama name now. Oh. Hi guys. We, as in my children, are going to revamp the living room. We are going to move the sofa in the garage for the party. And I don't know how this is going to work. But we're going to do it so that we can have this whole thing cleared out and nobody's on my couch because I don't want to hear about a smell. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to take this sofa and put it in the garage so that when Vadas come home in the morning, he gonna be like, what the entire fuck? I, and this is what he gonna say, mark my words, right or wrong, y'all gonna be, y'all gonna die laughing. He gonna say, I'm not putting it back either. I'm not putting it back. Y'all wanna move the sofa in the garage, y'all can put it back. I'm not moving the sofa back. That's what I don't wanna do. And then guess what I'm gonna say? Baby, come move this fucking sofa back in the garage, from out of the garage back in the house, please. Thank you. So yeah, we about to do this shit and get it done. I mean, my plan was to move the sofa all the way across the room. Why can't they just sit there? They're, they're not going to sit there because they're 13. They're, right. And they're they're like, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine Soraya and, and the girls gonna be what's sitting the other girl? Look, this is what they gonna be doing. Soraya, imagine Soraya, Aria. Imagine like 12 On the boys sitting down and boys going to be on the couch. Should they be like, definitely yeah, not. My, no. No. Don't grind your little funky ass on my couch. No.
we have officially moved all the chairs here. There is no more sofas here. So they have all this room to party. Party, party. I am gonna remove like some of my glass stuff from off this counter. Um, in this area, but it is open space and we're gonna do like flat lights and I'm gonna get some other stuff, dots or whatever, like construction dots I'm from my place. And yeah, Yo. we're gonna party. So we're gonna Yo. wait till daddy get home in the morning and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear. Who's just yelling at me? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Dang, who threw the song? Stop, we all really hurt each other. I'm sorry. Oh, you retard. <laughs> Are you guys, are you happy that you're 13? Are you happy that you're 13? Move! Are you happy? I'll get our legs later. Mm-hmm, we gonna get her ass. Normally we have confetti, but I feel like cleaning up all that shit. Happy birthday, baby. Thanks, Zach. I ran out of work. I ran out of work. I said happy birthday. In the middle of fucking putting shit up to people. Well, I just say fuck that shit. I got something baby happy birthday. They said <laughs> you're 13. I love you too. How does it feel to be 13? You're a teenager now. Oh shit. <laughs> this is crazy. Happy birthday, baby. Thank you. I have a picture of you, Dad. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. Baby, you need to make sure you clean up your room now, like a teenager. <sighs> He, you heard her tell my eye. Here he go. <laughs> my room is going to be clean. Yep, as a teenager, you got to always keep your room clean. First of all, who told you to drink out my cup? Oh, I was thirsty. You're a young adult now. So you got to act like that. You got to make sure you clean up your room. Okay. When are you coming over here? Look, look at we were, Oh, dude, that's okay. <laughs> when are you coming over here? Oh, um, I'm all Oh, you ain't coming? I love you. I gotta go back to work. I just ran out of work. Alright, I love you too. AJ asked. Alright, dude. See when I get home. See when I get home. Alright. Morning, guys. It is MJ's birthday, April 5th. I made an order for the food for the party. And, um,. I think at the party we're just gonna have hamburgers, hot dogs. We're gonna be on the grill. Well, okay, I'm gonna be on the grill because Vadis have a birthday party. Or no, actually, he's gonna be on the grill. I'll just have it all prepped and ready for him um, to grill up when he comes back home. I'll have them all smashed out because we're making mini smash burgers and hot dogs. And MJ wanted chips. And what else she said? Oh, and I'm making a, a tray of macaroni and cheese for the adults. Um, and I think I'm gonna make a small thing of baked beans. I was gonna order wings, but the place was that we ordered wings from wasn't answering, so that's fine. Hamburgers and hot dogs will do, um, cause ain't nothing like a good ass hamburger. I'm excited, and today we're gonna start semi-decorating, and then tomorrow my sister comes, and then Sam comes, and then hopefully my bestie Shakira comes, and we're going to um, finish decorating. I'm gonna do the balloons and stuff tonight with the boys and while I got Vadis with me so he can help me. I'm on my way to Orlando to get MJ her skirt for her party. Her colors that she have in her shoes is like neon, lime green, orange, like she has neon colors in her shoes. So I'm going to get her like a white skirt and a nice little like neon top that actually fits her. So that's what I'm doing right now. And I was gonna take you guys along with me, so let's go. Pray for me, I was gonna bring y'all, but I'm trying to get in and out because I have to make it back home by one to pick up MJ from school. So I'll show y'all what I got her when I leave the store.
I'll show you what I got her before I go in there and get her. Baby has a nail appointment at um, two. So I ended up, I was gonna get her a white skirt, but I didn't. So I ended up getting her for her glow party, this lime green tank, was well, like a crop top kind of like shirt. What we're planning on doing is like splattering it with paint, with the neon paint that match her shoes. Um, like the purple, the orange, and then with this black tennis skirt. I was going to get her a gold hinge skirt, but I decided to go ahead and get her that skirt because the gold hinge skirt, I don't know, the white wasn't just white for me. It looked like an off-white in there. So I'm very happy. I'm hoping she likes her outfit. So now I'm about to go pick her up and then we'll see y'all when we get in the car. Guess who's here? <laughs> Who the hell, Jackie, you got on? My boyfriend's because I almost got dress coded. I told you. Didn't I tell no, you? No, I walked past the dean the, the three times. It was the avid teacher that said that I needed a jacket. I told you. I told you. You better get him back his jacket when he get home. Okay, tell me if you like this. I like this. I'm going to wear this to school. I know you are. I'm going to wear this to school. Once It'll there. fit? Maybe, yeah. Boy, I was this close to getting a medium, and I'm like, mm-mm, that's not going to fit her. It's an extra small. Good. Because your waist tiny. What you trying to say? No, that's a good thing. That's a yes. good issue to have. This is cute. You like it? This is cute. Okay, yeah. It's going to match my shoes. Perfectly, right? So me and Daddy was thinking you want to splatter the neon paint on the shirt? Yeah. Okay. So he told me, we're not artists. We don't know how to do that. MJ is going to do it. Yeah. Don't mess up your shirt, please. I'm not. So we're about to get MJ nails done. Show them your before nails. Not done. And this is her before hair. I gotta go and um, wash her hair and blow dry it and everything so that she can go get her hair braided. I'm so excited to see how it's gonna look. I'm so excited too. I figured we'd make it so much TikToks. Are we gonna do the two pieces and then the up and a bun? I'm gonna have her put it like that. Why? Are you gonna leave it down for your party? I'm gonna leave it down. Okay. All right, guys, we'll show you makeover for her birthday. 13. Bye, guys. I've been waiting all my life for someone like you. You want jail on your nail? Guess how much MJ Nails was? What? Y'all owe me some money. Man, what, man? If they tell him how much your nails was. 70. You let that shit go to that. You let that shit go to that. Your daughter did. Let me tell you, rule number one. You never walk okay. in the... You never walk in the establishment and tell the people how much money you got. This girl said, I got $50 and 20, my brother gave me 50 and I got $20 at home, so I got $70. No, this is how I started. Jesse said, you want me to tell you the price now or after? So this is a training moment for MJ. This girl said, oh, after. He said, you never sit in nobody chair and let them tell you your price afterwards. You always wanna know your price beforehand. Well, still, you were supposed to tell her that. Though. I did tell her that. Put your seatbelt on, cause I don't, the thing blinging. Then, um, so then he, she, she was like, so, so he added, so listen, so he added it up for her. So he said, you want a deep French, that's 10. You want rhinestones on your nail, that's an extra 10. And you want French, and the full set itself is 50. And you want medium length. He let her get the medium and didn't charge her. 
He did. She didn't pay. She she paid for the design on each nail. She paid for the design on each nail and the French. But the he, he gave her the medium length. But it's an I, I I understand that's a new shop he opened. It ain't the same shop he was at. He a manager. He just opened. So. So MJ paid seventy dollars. And, and he said, "You what you don't do is you don't ever spend all your money." And he was like, "You, you yeah, work yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. We ain't telling her what not to do, but yeah, he stayed in tax land. We finessing y'all, writing y'all motherfucking face. I ain't gonna lie, her nose look yeah. good though. So I'm just saying. No better. Let me see him. Telling them don't ever spend all your money, but yeah, he took out and did money for him. Look, look, I pay, yeah. I, I pay forty. This is my nails. You ain't got shit on it. Shit, that shit, that little rhinestone shit, she could have put that shit on herself. No, I couldn't. I ain't got no damn rhinestones at home. You don't matter. You got them fake ass Cuban zirconias, goddamn thing. <laughs> you don't have that shit on for long. The fuck? Do that, do stick, do that not know how much nails cost? People pay one hundred and eighty dollars for nails. But I'm telling you, that's that's what, how much nails are. They know y'all feel like it should be that, so they just going and charge that. Hey, they already thank me. My look, look, my nails was forty dollars. Exactly, yours forty. So why didn't they tell you that your daughter's on? Because these uh wait uh uh she got tips on these my real nails and dip. I ain't get no tips. These my nails. The, the, fake, the fake nail. What do you mean? What's the tip? Okay. I don't know what the hell you talking about. Yeah, I ain't get no tip. You talking about she got a tip on? We should not let her get a fucking tip on. Okay, and then her nails would have been ugly because she bit them down. The color. Wanted, okay, it it yeah. Thank you. Your daddy is so aggy. He get on my nerves with that ugly. She always. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Men. You come back, girl. Why Ooh. are you? Why are you? Anyway, this is her before hair. Let me see. Stop right there. Turn around. Oh, I had cut it, by the way, y'all. That's why. Oh, my God. Turn around. Yo, she's from Atlanta, and she just moved here. She is fire. She did a fire job. All credit goes to Daddy. He found her. I'm the MVP. I'm the rap's MVP. Child. I'm looking exotic. I'm the reason. You ain't you the reason for the season? I'm looking exotic. This is a lot of space. No, Dad. I told you. It's going to be a lot of space. I'm looking exotic. I'm looking exotic. And LJ paid for the nails. Yeah, LJ paid Actually, for the no. nails. Mom paid for it. No, actually. LJ didn't. And then oh, Mom had to use the extra 20. That was on me. Mm. <laughs> I still want my 20, though. So, Run me my 20. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So daddy got to send 70. Uh, that was on me, baby. See, that was on daddy. Here goes grandma. Grandma gave you $20 for your birthday. 42, 41. Oh, snap. Walking presidential. So we got, we got to roll up the carpet and put it in the garage. And then we're going to do the square. Like, look, like, it's like, it goes in, inside. So you do a square and then you do another square on the inside and you make it go like, you know what I mean? So what's going to be the square? This? You want the dance floor to be that? Oh, yeah, 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 because I forgot the carpet off. I'm like, it's off, but that's because the carpet. Yeah, do that. You then you, it's tape, and then you're going to put another one inside it, so it's going to be like... Changes. Yeah. And then you put like an arrow. And then we're going to put arrows coming down the hallway, like arrow, arrow, arrow. So, yeah, y'all, yeah, we for to decorate. It's 24 hours before baby birthday party, so y'all already know we gotta decorate. We are the decorators. We are all the above. We gotta get it done. So it's time to get down to the nitty gritty. You already know how we puts the work in when we decorate, baby. Champagne do a motherfucking job. I'm supervising over no, shit. No, you're not. I'm watching Stop everybody, making sure everybody doing what the fuck they supposed to do. Cause see, I was supposed to be the manager. You feel me? In my past life. I'm a manager, you bro. <laughs> so I'm gonna manage these little motherfuckers, man. And make sure they do what the fuck they gotta do, bro, because that's what I'll put on this earth to do. Shit. So, you the one who bought the shit. You got it from Dollar Store? Hobby Lobby. Where they get it from then? Dollar Store? China. Oh, well. Okay. Yeah, man, so okay. we about to get it popping. We're gonna let y'all see what we got going on and uh, let y'all see the finished product in the process. We gonna let y'all see what we got going on and uh, let y'all see the finished product in the process.
day. Why are you in here and not in your room? You just told me to hold this. Okay, he's done. So we'll take your turn and go that way. <laughs> Very, very good. Don't just wasn't even tied. Oh my God! <laughs> What's the fuck? You're not gonna be touching it. Just Whoa, take it. Yeah. 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 yeah, just take it. That tape is still gonna work. Karma. Just take it. Yeah. Yeah. So we had a long night, we got it done. We just came back from an event, as y'all saw. Back home, about to put in more work for baby. I brought the family business home, as you can see, for baby's birthday party now. After our event we just had with a customer, now baby's a customer. So now I'm headed to the backyard to motherfucking cook now. I went from being a business owner to a motherfucking worker. How the fuck that work? It working though. We bike here. My son over there, supposed to be got there working. <laughs> he just got off a job and he on the job with me, man. LJ, we ain't gonna even worry about him, but that boy that ain't. That boy that, that boy that done. That boy one and done. So we about to get the grill. Yeah, just dunk that shit over the uh, gate. So we gonna start a new cremation, bro. <laughs> this is ashes, bitch. This is just done. Them ashes from fucking last year. <laughs> Last year ashes, bro. Nah, for real, <laughs> for real. Don't, don't dump it over there, cause the Mexican people gonna try to. I don't want to shoot nobody today. Do, put it over here in the bushes. I don't want to have to go off on nobody today. I'm trying. Oh no! But you gonna drop our grill? D does that grill come off? No. You sure? Try to try to lift it before you I do that. Find out. I'm gonna hold 
Oh, okay, because, boy, if you don't, boy, we, we need that. Oh, I would have sold. Oh, yeah, see, it is going to fall. Yeah, boy. You would have dropped that whole shit. Look at them dead people. Oh, my God. <laughs> Told you. Boy, you would have lost the whole grill. What the fuck? All right, y'all, so we... We ain't, we ain't experienced grillers, but you know, we do what we can do, what we can do it. So we about to do this shit, y'all. Let us get this shit right, we gonna fuck that with y'all. There go them smash bros right there. You feel me, man? Carlin got the bit lit. Y'all hear that bit sizzling. We're getting it done. It's, it's, it's all a part of the duty, man. Gotta do what we gotta do. See, LJ, he sleep right now. He go. <laughs> He was a sunny side up type of nigga. <laughs> so, we gonna let him sleep his little, whatever he gotta sleep off. By the time he wake up, we gonna be done. He a typical nigga. Nigga try to haul ass, they say they gonna take a quick nap, then turn into a motherfucking dream, and he come when everything done. And be like, oh, I was going help, I was just, you type shit. You feel me? Y'all know how to sing, though. Niggas haul ass, but it's all good, man. Car gonna take care of this shit. But we'll be back once we're done doing everything because we're on the time frame right now. We're cutting it close. Really? So we'll be back with y'all. We lost the fucking burgers in between the racks. <laughs> hey, shit kind of crazy, man. You feel me? Try to, uh, cook, but I can't see. Because <laughs> the motherfucker smoke. You know what I mean? Like, nigga, they cook with some goggles, dog. This shit here ain't gonna work. See? That bitch get none of my glasses, dog. I ain't no real cook, man. I ain't gonna really do this shit on the daily. They bro. wouldn't know. Yeah, they wouldn't know. They wouldn't know. You right, son. They wouldn't know. You right. We gonna get it done, now. Shit, they, they take a little bit in. <laughs> Oh, get that bit done now. It's getting burnt up. Got a little third degree burn right now, man. Try to get the motherfucking burger out of it. Sizzling off the grill. All right. Oh. Down that lost scene too. That bit fell right in the crack. That <laughs> That's crazy. Damn, boy, she ain't about 50 burgers, boy. I ain't trying to do all this shit. Cause I look like five guys. <laughs> <laughs> ain't trying to cook all these shit, man. You ain't hot dogs. Sheesh. So we had to swap out. Son, son had to take over, boy. I couldn't take no more. All right, you can take them bowls out right now. When you take that one out, you're going to throw them other two on there to keep that fire going. This should look good, y'all. Hold on, let Lee those.
quick ass wish. Quick ass wish. I know what I want. Alright guys, cupcakes for grass. Oh, I know. Cupcakes for grass. I know what you want. Wait a minute. Tonight is over. Thank you guys for joining us. I am exhausted. I finally get to go to sleep. We will see y'all on the next vlog.